Jasmine here with the Elements of Fate. I'm going to be doing a reading for Pisces. So Pisces, I hope this energy resonates with you. I hope this reading resonates with you. It's impossible for it to resonate with everyone. Energy is interchangeable, so it can... Um, play out from the perspective of whoever you may be dealing with, okay? So just keep that in mind always. Book a private reading if it doesn't resonate, okay? This is timeless. If you're attracted to the caption at any time, this may resonate for you. Please use discernment, okay? Use use your brain about the advice given if, if it's applicable for whatever you're experiencing, okay? Uh, I am a certified spiritual life coach, okay? So this is um, something I'm certified to do is give spiritual advice. Um, then took courses and classes on, you know, how to do it, I guess. <laughs> I don't think you need much skill on how to give advice, but if you guys are looking to book a session with me at the elementsoffaith.com is where you would go. What is coming up in the current um, energy for Pisces spirit? Thank you for clear, accurate information. All right. You guys, let's see here. We have the justice card, right? I feel like somebody is cutting off something, okay? It's clarified by the Ace of Wands. It almost feels like you, you want to go after something that you can't escape or something you can't have. I don't know why I'm feeling like that. What is crossing this energy or influencing? So some of you guys are trying to go after your family. Maybe maybe there's like a restraining order against you and your family or something like that. Because I feel, I feel restraint. I feel like I can't get. Cause, and then it's the justice system. So it's like maybe when the justice system puts, you know, um, you know, constraints on you it's usually like a restraining order so i really feel like somebody um i'm almost getting to something really petty like you can't be around your kids because your kid's mom put a restraining order or order on you and your girlfriend like made up some stuff so like it just feels like you want to go after something and you can't and you can't be like with your family yeah the four swords yeah so i feel like someone doesn't even know where their family is at or they're away from them, or they have to wait to see their family. Like, I really feel like someone wants to go after their family or be with their family, um, and, and they can't. What is um, in the crowning energy? The for, What is in the focus? What is in the focus viewpoint for Pisces? Yeah. Yeah, you guys are thinking of a master plan here, how to bring things back into balance. How can I get this these items to my kids? How can I be with my kids? How can I talk to my kids? How can I tell my kids I love them? How can I send them this these letters? Are they getting my packages? How can I go back to court and tell the judge, you know, the truth about this matter? Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. I feel like somebody might be in court for child support. You might need to um, readjust your child support. You might be saying like, um, this, like, like, I feel like someone needs to reevaluate child support. Simple as that, okay? Somebody's paying probably way too much. And I feel like somebody is being shucked and jive in court. Um, yeah, somebody's taking their money. Yeah. It's like, I almost feel like this person don't have to work because they're taking all your money. What is the past energy for Piscerians? Yeah, um, past energy. Gosh, this just feels like you and this person used to be cool. Damn. Wow. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck happened? This is some great fucking energy. <laughs> For this shit to feel so horrible. Clarify the sun card, spirit. The moon. Wow. So y'all had to be dealing with somebody who's just trifling. Because this past energy is way too fucking good. I almost feel like someone seen what you had. And, and and this is kind of like a crazy energy. This person could have even got, got pregnant 
just to have your baby, just to, to really reap off of your benefits. Like this energy is way too good. Now, I ain't gonna lie. You could have fucked up here and had a third party situation and they found out and they went totally vindictive. They was like, yep, I've been waiting to catch your motherfucking ass and I'm about to hit the jackpot on your motherfucking ass. But I feel like this has always been this person's mindset. Okay, this person has always felt like a motherfucker fuck up, up on me, <laughs> they better be motherfucking careful. Like this person goes after people who are, you know, you're well off. So if you fuck up, I'm going to be well off too. That's what's going to well, that's what it's going to be. I mean, this feels like someone was well off and then some secrets got shined on. Okay? And this motherfucker took that secret and whatever the hell you was doing and they motherfucking made that shit work and twerk and they motherfucking favor all in front of the judge, okay? That was like, yeah, a <laughs> judge also yeah okay it feels like they've been they was getting all kind of evidence and shit and, and piecing the shit together you know you gotta have proof i don't feel like you was up to game about when you go to court you have to have like actual evidence like proof tangible proof so this person like knew that so it's like every little fucked up shit you did with your human being um, we all fuck up. This person has documented it because this shit looked too cool. It's like you fucked up probably one time. Maybe you got caught cheating. You know what I'm saying? Maybe you got caught cheating a couple of times, but I do see that it shows me you would take care of your family. This motherfucker up in the courtroom. Oh yeah. Putting shit to rest. Yes. In the courtroom. Like I almost feel like she ate, this person ate you alive in the courtroom. Yeah. Like. It felt, it feels like a major loss. Like, oh my God. Yeah, look at courtroom. Whenever I seen this, I'm thinking about court. I think about like Supreme Court. Um, you guys might not have been in front of the Supreme Court, but I feel like y'all was in front of a court. What is the outcome? This is, this is just crazy. I want to clarify this sun card again. Like this, the, a few, the past looked like it was cool. But I feel like someone always had a thought process of if this motherfucker, like they would talk to their girlfriends and their mama and perhaps their mama even raised them like this. You know what I'm saying? I don't think like this. So this is so far fetched for, for me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I do feel like this person found out that you could have been cheating or something. Yeah, stepping outside of your marriage. Yeah, finding text messages. They will screenshot them, send them to themselves, and was like, yep, you fucked up, yep. I just feel like this is very immature and very shady, very trifling, very tre treacherous, because the past energy looked way too good for this shit to be playing out like this. This is crazy. I think that you were actually caught off guard. It's like, damn, like, why are we doing all of this? Like, this is crazy. Like, I fucked up, yeah, but fuck. Damn, yeah, I guess you learned your lesson. Anywho, what is a near future outcome? Yeah, you just you just want to be done with this. You just want to move forward in a positive way. Like, can we like correct this? Like, can we? Cor You're trying to find a way to correct it so you can. I'm feeling like see your children. Like, it's like, you just, at this point, just want to play whatever role so you can see your, yeah, nine of wands. I feel like you guys could have been going through this for nine years, nine months, nine weeks, however long. It's been a long time. And you're like, look, let's cut the bullshit. Like, what is it that you need me to do? You know what I mean? Like, I, <laughs> I don't really want to play this game, which, you know, we've been doing this for a long time. Like, what is it that you really want? Like, do you want me to apologize to you? You want me to tell you certain truth? Like, what do you want me to do? Tell you the truth about certain things? Like, do you want me to tell you the truth if I, you know, whatever the truth may be? I don't know. But this is, um, I feel like you're tired and you're ready to move on. Some of you could even be ready to move on because you're just like, I'm going to just let the court system work it out. You know what I'm saying? I feel like some of you is, um, yeah, when I said let the court system work it out, that's the star card. That's faith. That's hope. That's hope for tomorrow. That's hope in a dark place. It's just allowing the darkness to pass and having faith that the light will come in the morning. Um, so I feel like some of you are just like, look, I'm just going to let this like court system work out. It's like you guys feel like 
no matter which way you pull that you're going to get the same results it's almost like you don't have any room or say so in this it's like no matter what i do no matter what i say I can't get through to I can't get through to her, so I'm just I'm gonna have to be hopeful. I'm gonna have to believe in faith. What what else on this Eight of Cups? I also feel like someone just keeps taking more and more right up from under your nose. What else for this Eight of Cups? Yeah, I feel like the best thing that you can do. Yeah, it's like walk away right now. Um, I'm feeling like the best thing that you can do is focus on your mental health, your spiritual health, your emotional health, your emotional wellness here. It does say that this thing has been draining, draining, draining you. I mean, probably draining your bank account, just draining you. Your skin probably look dried up. You probably look tired. You probably have bags under your eyes. You're probably hunching over a little bit. People are probably like, bruh, man, your aura is like, man, you, you looking real, you know, bad out here, bruh. You know what I'm saying? It just feel like at this point in time, it's really important for you to start depositing things back into yourself, you know, positive self-talks and really, you know, getting your momentum up and, and winning again. Because I feel like whatever this is, whatever this court thing is, um, I feel like it's draining your energy. I, I feel like your aura is looking dingy. I feel like your bank account might be looking like it might still be, you know, up there, but I feel like it's dwindling. And I feel like we lost, we lost focus. We allowed someone, we gave to someone too much power over our reality. Even when we go through a tough situation, it still doesn't cause for us to give up all of our power. And I feel like someone's giving up all, of that, all their power. And I feel like you're in a season where you're about to develop it back. And I recommend that you do. What is the outcome for Pisces? What is the outcome for Pisces? What is the outcome for Pisces? devil card again this is really hard yeah i feel like you got to really try hard to put deposit love back into yourself here because this devil card is showing up again so it's like we really are in a low vibrational energy here i feel like it's real hard and tough and there goes that temperance again that i got over here yeah, we really are going to really have to bring balance into what's negative. Like, look, don't think like that, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, nah, don't do that. That ain't going to do you no good. Hey, put that bottle down. Drink it ain't going to cut it. Look, last time you drank, you called you called her up and that's why you got the other, you know, it's like some stuff like that. It's like, look, man, you need to do this, man. Go get your hair cut, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Put that drink down, get your hair cut. Yeah, she whack, but you can't be losing yourself over this, man. You too good for this. So I feel like someone really is trying to bring you back into balance like trying to restructure you really get you back aligned like look you know what i'm saying you need to really get your shit right you know what i'm saying you need to you know tighten up that's what i'm hearing like you need to tighten up you know you need to restructure yourself you know you need to get with the program like get back on you need to harness that energy and, and stabilize yourself that's what i'm seeing yeah you know what i'm saying like you, you know it's like energy like she over there living living good and you letting this motherfucker ring you out you know what i'm saying emotionally mentally spiritually all of that so it really is it, it really is not a good energy here gosh yeah seven of, yes words the yeah, i don't like that energy at all someone is um, really wearing you dry. I feel like there's a situation, person, place, or thing that's wearing you out, tearing you down. But I feel like there's some good energy around you that's trying to remind you to keep your head up, keep focused, keep going. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, this too shall pass. But you know what I'm saying? While you're going through it, remember everything that you do have. You know what I'm saying? That's what's going to make you walk upright and keep your chin held right high because you still got everything to be grateful for. I mean, you're still living and breathing. You still got two arms, two legs, whatever. You know what I'm saying? You still have a mental mind, a mental capacity to to think of better things. Maybe you didn't make the best choice yesterday, but today you have a mind that can really um, bring the ideas of better choices, better decisions. You have great people really telling you what you should do, how you should do it. So I honestly recommend that you take the advice of those close to you. Use discernment always, you know, when it comes to advice. You know what I'm saying? But I do feel like there's some people that can really speak life into you. And I think that's good. What else for Pisces? What else for Pisces? What else for Pisces, Spirit? Thank you. 
it says prosperity lie ahead. So I feel like, yeah, every like giving it to God, um, trusting in your faith, you know, trusting in light after a dark time. I do feel like you are going to get um, things will work out in your favor. You just you just really need to change your your um, your energy right now. You need to move in an evolved way and not in a reckless way. Confidence is key. Yeah, prosperity, like knowing, like you seeing the end result and visualizing it, acting out like, yeah, I want that court case. You know what I'm saying? Will allow you to actually live in that reality. Trust me, it's the secret. Try it. All right, what else for Pisces energy? Thank you, Spirit. What else for Piscerians energy? Thank you. It says adjustments are required. You need to adjust the way that you're thinking. You need to adjust the way that you're drinking. You need to adjust the negative things that you have deposited into your reality. It's time for a change. These things are not boosting you up. It's taken away from you. Prosperity lies ahead. If you just, if you stop drinking and paying all this money and going gambling, whatever the hell you doing, it, you will have more money if you stop doing these things. So you need to make adjustments so you can have more and be confident and have conviction that you can do this. You owe yourself this. You know what I'm saying? Have the willpower to conquer whatever this is. Because this is too much. Yeah, look at the big picture. Yes, the bigger picture. And it says your dreams is a practical plan. So you need to look at a bigger picture. And I do hear people saying, like, look at you, bro. Like, what are you doing? You know what I'm saying? Like, you really need to get your shit together. Like, you ain't acting right these days, man. Fuck all of that, man. You can't even be like, oh, her, her, her. Like, you need to look in the mirror at yourself, bro. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's like someone's really like, nah, <laughs> we're not about to let you just tumble and fall and act like you you ain't got shit to do out here in these streets you got kids to raise and shit you got a whole job to go to like pick yourself up lift your chin up king you know put your crown on king so um yeah that's 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 your reading pisces um it's pretty deep it's pretty you know dep you know depressing um and i hope that you do not lose everything that you have I hope that those people who are inspiring you, encouraging you, all that shit stays in your fucking corner. Because right now, that's what you need. A good community, good support system. Peace.